going on can't lie this mix you've always got to start your Mondays off right you know what I mean we need to bring energy to the week you know what I mean start as we mean to go on the old week is in the past we move forward how is everybody Monday, Monday, the start of the week. Daisy, love for the resub. I see you, I see you. Welcome in, everybody. Breadboy, Pandora, Ark and Stoner, Cypher. Bonjour, Ellen. Salut, ça va? How are we all doing? It is Monday. The beginning of the week. How was everybody's weekend? Good, I hope. Chilled, I hope. Active, I hope. Whatever you did, I hope you had a good, good time. We are at the start of a, it's going to be a good week. I feel it in the air. I woke up feeling motivated. You know what I mean? I woke up feeling super, super motivated. Um... I can't go to the gym at the moment because something's wrong with my shoulder. But I was like, you know what? I'm still going to have a good day. I'm still going to have a good day. Um, 
pass that motivation this way. Listen, that's my thing. Motivation is my thing. Very chill week. Hurricane cancelled all your work and classes. Josie, I hope you're good. I know there's a hurricane going on in the Florida, Miami region, I believe. I hope you're good. I've got family there as well. So I wish you and anybody else affected well. Fingers crossed you're all back on your feet very, very soon. A bracelet, you kept it chill. Unpacking luggage. Trying to plan your outfit for NYC. I love to hear it. I love to hear it. New York City, yeah? New York City. Tricky. Love for the sub. I see you, Tricky. Helmet squad. Helmet squad. The helmet may get brought out today. Who knows? Who knows? Brianna, rainy weekend for you. Me as well. London has uh, entered its annual eight months of rain. And the hype train has begun as you can see up there, my wonderful, wonderful face. <laughs> Jeez, Maury, first time chatter, welcome in. How you doing? Lazy Bear, you went to the pumpkin patch. You don't know what to carve on it. Oh yeah, Halloween, 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 Halloween. What are we, 17 days away? 17 days away. I know you're prepping your costumes. I know you're thinking about what your motives are gonna be like. Selena, what, 18 months of rain? Oh yeah, like this is our thing in the UK. We're an island, isn't it? This is what we do. Wind and rain, wind and rain, wind and rain, wind and rain. We'll do that for like 300 days. Then you'll get like a bit of sun, then we're back to, back to the old wind and rain. Wind and rain. Did you decide on the next horror game? Or oh, TJ, love for the sub first and foremost. I appreciate you. Fears to Fathom, we we got to finish that. We got to finish Fears to Fathom before we move on. But I don't know. That's that's a <laughs> I can't lie. It's giving me life. Fears to Fathom is giving me life. Or should I say scaring the life out of me? But uh, <laughs> that's that's good. We're on episode three right now, three of five, and we will be continuing that tomorrow. Shelly, love for the sub. I see you, Shelly. How's it going? Mm, yeah, carve something spooky into your pumpkin. It's got to be done. It's got to be done. Lazy, something spooky or how creative are you? If you're like not a very good artist like me, maybe just go something simple. Or if you're sick of art, maybe even just do like a pumpkin face that's creative. Do you know what I mean? Switch up the shapes for the eyes, the nose, and the mouth. I've never carved a pumpkin. I'm just <laughs> I'm going on what I think what I think you should do. But fingers crossed, you get something nice done. Do 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 do. Where do we even get pumpkins here? Like, Tesco? I don't think I've ever bought a pumpkin. I don't think I've even seen one, like, in the, in the, the aisles. Are they there all the time? Are they there all the time? I feel like... I must be blind. If they're there all the time, how can I miss them? Like, they're quite big. <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? Versace, love for the resub. I see you. What's going on? Mm, Mary, welcome in. Welcome in. No, real talk. I don't think I've seen a pumpkin. Like, obviously, you see the kiwis, the bananas, the pineapples, the watermelons. Pumpkins, though. Hmm. They've been avoiding me. What are they up to? Why are they avoiding me? I mean, everybody else seems to have seen them. <laughs> Except me. Raw. I'm gonna I'm gonna see tomorrow. I might buy one. I might buy one. I might buy one. I might buy one and carve it. And carve a face into it. Cause I've never ever done that before. Mm-hmm. 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 Bro's never down the vegetable aisle. Sogi. Nah, that's my thing. That is my thing. Vegetables, actually, I kind of just eat the same vegetables on repeat. I don't really... I'm just broccoli, avocados, carrots. 
broccoli, avocados, carrots. That's all I do. I don't do salads. I don't, it's just those three, broccoli, avocados, carrots. I just spam that. <laughs> I just spam that. Pumpkin carving stream, who knows? Yeah. How big are pumpkins? What, like, probably like a foot wide? That could be cool, you know? That could be cool. No promises, but mm, the the you've planted the seed, the pumpkin seed, if you will. I see what you're doing. I see what you're all doing. I see what you're all doing. Do BG free costumes. The helmet is ready. Ooh, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. It is MCM London next week. Wow, that's come along fast. 25th of October is the first day. That's 11 days away. That is going to be the first, sorry, the second time everybody is together. The first time was last year. I ain't seen, I ain't seen Sam. I ain't seen Sam, a.k.a. Carla, in raw, like, a while. <laughs> a while. I like, quite a long time. I'm sure, I can't even remember. It must be like six months. It must be like six months, you know, since I've seen Sam. That's a long time. So yeah, it's gonna be good to catch up with with my, my co-stars and, and show them some love and yeah, it's exciting. It's very, very exciting times. It's very, very exciting times. Um. BG3 has been a true blessing. I wouldn't even be on stream right now if it wasn't for that game. So mad, mad love for that game. And we will also be playing D and D live, which I'm so shook of. And I think it's a two hour game. I think it's a two hour long game. There's nowhere to hide. There's nowhere to hide. It's one thing playing D and D, yeah. There's another thing playing D and D with Bare people in the crowd. Bare people in the crowd. I'm just like, ah. <laughs> what dice do I use? No, it's going to be fun. I've got to bring my A game. I've got to bring my A game. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. No, exciting time. I think it will be live streamed. Like I said before, as soon as I have more info on that, <clears throat> I will send it your way. I'm going to riz them all. The PhD in quantum risics might have to get brought out. You're not wrong, TJ. It might have to get brought out. The people doing the D&D is me, Neil, Sam, and Dev, I believe. Me, Neil, Sam, and Dev. Yeah. Yeah. And the auditorium at MCM London, oh my gosh. If they put us in the one they did last year, Gemma, thank you for the sub. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing? If they put us in the room we were in last year, bear in mind, yeah, MCM London is like one of the biggest cons in the world. And uh, like that was like a baptism, baptism of fire to do as my first one. And I remember the first panel show we did, Oh my days, bruv! Like, obviously, I'm mad nervous in it. Like, shit! Like, gotta go on stage. Don't know what to say. Never done one of these panels before. And then I've gone out, and I was thinking, oh, there's gonna be like, I don't know, a few hundred people. No, just multiply that by a few. There was bare people, and it was dark in it, so you could just kind of see like little lights in the crowd. Huh. If I play D&D on that stage, you better send me your prayers, please. Hashtag prayer. Hashtag prayer for Theodore. Mucho gracias. Mucho gracias. Mucho gracias. Gemma, thank you for gifting the subs to Chalky Milk and Sivonia. I appreciate you. My friends, it's time to dive back in. Are we ready? This is act two. And for those that don't know, 
I'll um I'll fill you in. I'll fill you in. I <laughs> I need to be humble. I have the umbral gems. I have the umbral gems. All four. They're coming like they're coming like infinity stones. I might just snap my fingers and I've got that that Thanos energy. Do you know what I'm saying? I have them all in my possession. So we need to figure out our next move because having my infinity in brackets umbral gems, I believe it's time to move on to the next phase. What that next phase is, I don't know. I do not know. We shall see. And what I may do, what I may do is double back. Double back. Thanos snap half of Feyru. <laughs> Imagine I had Thanos in my party. Jeez. He definitely wouldn't miss. But he's not. I love these lots of pieces with their leather helmets. Look at them. Look at them. You can't snap your fingers. You wouldn't make a good Thanos. Really, Brianna? The thing about snapping your fingers... Am I going to... Yeah. The thing about snapping your fingers is I used to think that's the snap, innit? For those that can't snap their fingers, it's not that that snaps your fingers. It's your middle finger slapping your palm. That's what actually makes the noise. It's not your actual fingers there. So you just need to get that traction. You see me? You can do it, Brianna. You can do it. Right. My friends, here we are. Here we are, here we are. Kerry, welcome in, welcome in. This is Yurgir's bedroom. This is his bed. A bed made of corpses. Wonder if the gods are watching me. Right. Beautiful. As you can see, we've got some some lovely uh, interior design here. You know? Fairy lights. You could have you could have, you know, flowers, I don't know. Beautiful curtains. Or just hear me out on this one. Why don't you just dismember a body? You know, I'm talking, you know, ch chop an arm off. Maybe chop a leg off um, and just hang it on a piece of rope. I mean, try something different. Feng Shui energy is is very strong here. Very, very strong. Yogi, I love what you've done with the place. It's giving I need to leave. It's giving goodbye. <laughs> Oh, I'll be your interior designer, Lazy Bear. Trust me, I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Wait, that does look like Woolburn, you know. Can we get a... Can we get a... Cl Imagine. A ghoulish display. It is clear the victim suffered greatly before dying and being put on show. Oh, man. Woolburn. Karma, 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 karma. Game of mama, I know, I know, right? Anyway, we've got what we needed. We've got the Infinity Stone. Let's get out of here. There's just pools of blood, a wall burn, fairy lights. Like, we don't need this. We don't need this. Oh, gosh. Right, so... Do I double back? Do I move forward? This is the question. So, Balthazar, he's in the temple below the Thor mausoleum. He asked us to help him find the relic for Ketherick. Okay. We met Jahira, the leader of the Harpers. She told us to go to Moonrise Towers to infiltrate the Cult of the Absolute and find the source of Ketherick's power. Disciple Zarel, who I uh, 
Yeah. Oh, I swear this game doesn't clock like Zarel Zarel's gone. Despite that, Disciple Varel has asked us Zarel even has asked us to find out what happened to Kefric Form's advisor, Balthazar. Okay, so this is all linking back to Balthazar. Zarel's gone. We need like a missing person, like you know reward money or something one umbral gem if you find her because the way people are moving in this game it's like she's not dead they'll mention her i'm like oh i don't know how to break it to them a live laugh love sign that would go perfectly just above woolburn's head spine just above the head i think that would uh be beautifully beautifully welcoming irish welcome in so quest wise right for the culture look how many i've done jeez do i so these are all act two do i have any act ones to do have i done all my act ones kithrak voss appeared at our campsite and claimed the one in the artifact is the key to liberating Githyanki people from Vlakith's tyranny. We agreed to meet him in Baldur's Gate, where he knows of someone who can break the artifact's resident free. That sounds a bit dodgy. That sounds like he's got some illegal link <laughs> to making that happen. <laughs> that sounds very criminal activity-esque. Just come to Baldur's Gate, mate. I know someone who can do it for free. Trust me, I would never let you pay. Just, just come meet me in Baldur's Gate. You know what I mean? Dodgy from Kithrak Voss. Very, very dodgy. <laughs> Is Short King Wolven still alive? I mean, if we're going off the evidence in that other room in Somnia, it's not looking good, bruv, man. It's not looking good, but it might not be Wolburn. It might not be. It could be a clone. There have been other clones in the Gauntlet of Shah, as we've seen. Clones of these beautiful looking people. So, all hope is not lost. Right. I have enough humble gems. I should insert them into the altar. That's the next step. If I want to move forward. I swear I've done this. Shadow Cursed Lands. Under the Temple of Shah. The Night Song. I swear I'm, I'm in the temple. Finds Evlor. Okay, this is all afterwards. Right. A long list of missing persons. Yeah, we should put Zarel on there too. Because she's missing too, right? Right? She's missing! Missing, you know, I never do anything to Zarel. Come on, come on. Good friend of mine, actually. Good friend of mine. I think, my friends, I'm not gonna double back. I'm gonna go forward. And I am gonna put these gems into the altar and see what happens. Let me chat to my guy Balthazar first, actually. See if... Uh... You're not wrong, Geeky. You're not wrong. Where could Zarel be? Where could Zarel be? This feels like a, a Scooby-Doo mission right now. Find Zarel. I'll go back to the room where she was last seen. And then... Maybe we can prove it. Let me have one more shot at this door. Because this door is a bit... Annoying. Sharp as ever. William? I'll Hold on. I can do. It's not you to do it. Shadow heart in it. Let's see what my touch can do. 
Is it you? No. I'm to be a starian, isn't it? Oh. Oh, you lot. Qualified. Have a lot on my mind. None of you are qualified for this. In it. Yeah. You. You're nearly qualified, but not really qualified. I need qualified technicians only. I'm sorry. It's none of your days. It's all, it's all fair. None of you are qualified. It's fine. I've read your LinkedIn profiles, and none of you are qualified for that job. I have something to ask. Balthazar. Not lost your nerve, I hope. I tend to remove those from my creations. Too much fuss. Hmm. Do you know what? Let me just quick save you. For the culture. Just for the culture and if you're unsure of what the culture is in a in this stream you're gonna find out soon this is gonna be for the culture what to do you're gonna soon find out everybody who doesn't know this guy's way too cocky. Way too cocky. I think, bruv, you need to get word to K dot. You need to be humbled. Just giving out orders. How am I gonna tackle you? Right. So, where am I needed? Where are you needed? All right, just slap them with this, bruv. Here we go. Three, two, one. Seems your actions have earned you an enemy. Oh, and yeah. Fight. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Bring the chaos, bruv. Temporarily hostile. Why don't you be all the way hostile, Balfazar? Why don't you be all the way hostile? Because I am going to deal with you. I hope. Please. Please, can I deal with you? Right. So, you just stay low-key for a second. Oh! William! Took off almost 50% of Balthazar's health just then. Let us make short work of this. Don't you dare run. Don't you dare run. Just, yeah, stay here. Right. Oh, are you? It's giving... It's giving run from a Pokemon battle. Bruv, you stay there. I reckon... I can't get to you. You're so lucky, bruv. You're so, so lucky. Ooh. Oh, Balthazar's got 21 health. Didn't even plan this. This is just a spontaneous little side mission. I was like, yeah, let me try. I'm probably going to get smoked. But turns out, I'm the one smoking him. This is, this is sensational. Let me not speak too soon. Let me just get on with my job. You, what are you doing? You're just, I don't know, just head bobbing. Just, yeah, bruv, this tune is sick, bruv. Jeez, don't even know what's going on behind me because this tune is so sick. Just headphones in, AirPods on, like, love that from you, Flesh. Love that from you. Just keep bobbing your head. As for the rest of you, how we doing? William, 30 health. Sharp, 42. And my Tav and Carlac, full health. Sensational scenes. 
Bless is just bobbing along to silence. <laughs> bobbing along to silence. Right. Next move. I can't get there. It's got to be go for flesh. Right, we're going for flesh. Hello to Theo and chat from the Mojave Desert. Welcome, Dove. Where's the Mojave Desert? You're in the Mojave Desert. We need we need enlightenment. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Karlak. Oh my gosh, I think I'm gonna kill this guy, you know. Hang on, let me just see if I'm I should even be killing him. Oh, well, he's getting smoked. See you later, bruv. I do my own thing in this game. <laughs> I do my own thing in this game. Sorry, bro. I'm about to go hang you up like Wolbert. You're going to be the new fairy light, bruv. You are going to be the newest fairy light in your gear's pad. Interior design on 1,000. Final blow for Shark. Oh, unlucky. Unlucky, unlucky. You're in Nevada. Okay. Of course there's deserts in the US. Of course. Wow. I hope you're having a good time, though. I hope you are having a lovely, lovely time. A better time than... Uh, than this person with four health. Oh, yes. I can hit this. You'd probably die. Oh, my gosh, he's dead. The rest of you. The rest of you. I'm going to give you the opportunity to run. Because right now what we're doing is... is It's iconic. It's iconic. Rach Powell, welcome in. You joined at the right time, Rach Powell. And if I can actually clear this room, one thing we've got to deal with is you. Because I have a feeling you're going to be in a lot of trouble when you get up. But usually Balthazar has smoked me in like five turns. And I just treated him like a, a cigar, a cigarette, a vape, smoked, left on the floor. This is this is beautiful. The newest fairy light is born. Right, who next? Let me go for I say start dealing with flesh, you know. Flesh is going to be a bit of a problem. Right. Balthazar flavoured vape. <laughs> a Balthazar flavoured vape. Jeez. What is that going to taste like? <laughs> I don't want to know. <laughs> Right. Who first? You? Ghoul medic number one. Sayonara. You're with the ghoul medic ancestors right now. Alright, he's up. Someone put his airpods back in. Oh, nice. He's only gone hit a 23. Right. Sharp. Wait. You can't heal. I may have fucked up. I may have fucked up. Shit. Alright, this just got infinitely harder. But there is still hope. There is still hope. Hmm. 
No, none of these. Flesh is going to be a big, big problem. No giving up. There is no giving up, Flynn. Don't worry. Don't worry. Blade will not bend, but the blade needs to drink his juice. And by juice, I mean my super healing potions, which I feel like I've drank all of them. You greedy, greedy companions. Did you drink them all? You, you know you know when someone just leaves like a little bit of juice in the carton in the fridge? They didn't even do that. They just drank it all. You greedy, greedy people. You didn't leave me a bit of juice. You didn't leave me one drop. Where do I go from here? Wow. Okay. Wow, we have no juice. <laughs> we have no juice. All right, say no more. This is just going to have to be a... a go for it, basically. This one. Yeah. Come on. No holding back. It's going to be very close. That's all I know. Uh, let's say go for the Gaussian. No, go for flesh. Go for flesh. If we take flesh out, we might just be able to do this. Oh. Flesh, chill out, mate. Right. I reckon. Oh my. Shadow Heart just hit a 15. That is the highest hit Shadow Heart has ever, ever done. So I'm just a bit. I'm pretty buzzing over that, I can't lie. I'm pretty buzzing over that. Wonderful from you, Shadow Heart. Oh my gosh, flesh is almost gone. Oh, don't fucking jinx this. I wonder if this is worth the cost. You need to get up and you need to hit. This is why I have the Yugi's flare, by the way. Because the healing right now <laughs> is very needed. What's wrong with you? Oh, you're paralyzed. Oh. Here we go, you're back. Maybe... No, it's not. Don't heal yet. No. Lovely Karlak. Okay, Flesh. Flesh. Flesh has killed my Tav. I've clocked. Whenever my Tav dies, Will's like, Baldurin's bones, no! And I'm like... My... Will really cares about my Tav. No one else seems to say anything. It's just that every time. Will gets it. That's it, Arkenstoners. Will gets it. The rest are just like, we didn't even like that guy anyway. But no, not William. Not William. I can hit. We are so, so close. So close. Maybe. Yeah. Okay. Oh, this is going to be tight. This is going to be extremely tight. Oh, shit. <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh, no. 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 No, 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 no. Oh. Shut up. It's gone. You're probably wondering how I ended up in this situation. Um. Damn. If I had Shadow Hearts healing, this fight would have been 
a breeze, a light wind. Um, how am I gonna do this? Do I save shot? I need a safe shot. That was probably the wrong option. But if he goes for her, and I can use her as like a human shield in the next turn, perfect. Let's just hope flesh kills Shadow Heart. Don't take that quote out of context, please. Just, we need that quote in context. In context. All right, darling. You just. He's just chill. Right. Parlax doing sensationally well. Just holding it down over here. No! Yes, you... No. No, he's healing flesh. You snake. You little Judas. You, ow, nah, 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 you can't, you can't be doing that. You can't be doing that. No. What power? Bro, the way I was so close. I'm so flabbergasted, Phoebe. Feed you, should I say? Because this... Oh, he's got 55 health now. Oh, jarring. Right. Parlak. What's it gonna take? Oh my gosh. It's just flesh left. Can we do it? Can we do it? Mm -hmm. Right. Go on. That's going to end up being Carlet versus Flesh. Yep, ah. man. What? Did they really drink all my juice? Oh. He's lot, man. Potion of healing. This, oh, okay. Dead. They, they left me like 100 milliliters of juice. 100 milliliters of juice, man. It is better than nothing. You're not wrong. Beggars cannot be choosers. Drink it. Drink it, drink it, drink it. Gosh, we're so close. Right. Um, this is it. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. He's on eight health. And it's his turn. If he does some kind of... Oh, this is so close, man. Brother. Be a gentleman. I know you're angry. I know it's not been a good day. I know we took your AirPods out. And you were listening to that sick tune by that band called Silence. But if you just let us roll through, this will be... It will be a beautiful moment. Your name will be written in the history books. Flesh. The head bobber. I like's dead. Oh my gosh, the final blow. Can you do this? If you hit this. <laughs> oh my gosh. Have we done it? Why was there not a noise? I think we've done it. But I'm disconcerted because there was no like, like noise. Why did I not get XP from that? 
<laughs> Something's wrong. No, 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 no. We've won, question mark. I'm Ron Burgundy. Oh, what do I do? All right, maybe we have... Maybe we have one. Let me just save, just in case. Uh, yeah. Oh, it was a, just a dramatic death. Okay, 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 okay. Defender of the people. What? Exit turn based mode. What, I can't even do that? What's going on, bruv? Uh, I'm hit. I know. I'm sorry, but I'm trying to. Made at the ready. I'm at the ready too, bruv. I don't know what's going on. Well, Hold up. Then. I should unwind and carry. My game bugged. Oh, is my game bugged? Maybe it is, you know. Mad. Everything's dead. That's a bit techy. Why did I not get XP? I feel robbed. I didn't get XP from the head bobber. Up and at him. Okay, get up. All right, you're up. Never a dull moment. Sharp as ever. My lady. I'm sorry, darling. I can't actually get you up right now. End your turn. End your turn. Environmental turn. Who is the environment? Nature. Nature needs uh, to have a turn. Right. I'm done. See you lot later. That was weird, isn't it? That was weird. Maybe it is... I don't know. One move ahead. Oh my gosh, do you know what? I don't think I can long rest, you know. You cannot fast travel right now. Something fishy's going on. Something a word if I may. Right. With us. Not over, then through. No, get out of turn based mode, man. This is getting annoying. Thou walkest alone. I think my game's bugged On all out. These harsh nights, thou hast sought no company. Are you calling me what are you saying I ain't got a partner? Wow. Yeah, the love of my life is none of your business, skeleton. Love is no domain of mine, but it is often cited as the purpose of mortal life. Wherefore turnst thou from it? And thus right. thou art alone. What I'm going to try and do is save you. And then re up my game. There's something weird going on. Interesting. So, hmm. Bottom is, I hope I can as well, or we're going to have to go back. And Artemis, I nearly called you mummy again. I ne nearly, <laughs> I nearly, nearly did. Right, are we out of this turn-based mode thing? All right, you're dead. We we understand that. Please help. 
Okay, orcs. Awkward, awkward, awkward. So... My game's absolutely fucked, I reckon. I reckon my game's bugged. Pride of the gate. Wow. Didn't mean to click alert. I I I don't I think I've got a I think my game's cooked. My game is cooked. Do I want chat to help? Yes, please. Chat, are we cooked? Light on my feet. Oh, please. No, I need to know the info. I need to know that. I need to pick up Sharp. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate you all. Sharp? Shart, Shart, are you the reason for our, for our woes? Thinking our game's bugged. Shart. <laughs> she did, Jenny. <laughs> she did. No. We're still in this mode, bruv. Wits and blades always sharp. Carlac, oh no, your Carlac's dead. Defender of the people. The environment still needs to have a turn. Weird. Right. Let me go back to camp and now try. Right. Can we revive? Go ahead. Whoops, I'm not listening. you. Not you, not you, not you. My bad. Withers? Where are you, old oh, buddy, old oh, pal? No time to rest. Moving ahead. Something okay. On my mind. Mama K? Spins along as it Mama K having a dirt nap in heaven. Dost thou require? But we're going to bring her back. We're going to bring her back. Mayhaps a resurrection instead. A resurrection, por favor. Then thou must return with the proper payment. I've got that, bro. This is the price of balance. Two bills. Well, can't you? Buy yourself something nice with us. Keeping my distance. Right. For a moment. If Withers doesn't fix this turn-based stuff, I am officially cooked. Show me something, Withers. Blue sick. Yes, I have done it. No, I, like, no, when it comes to in-game stuff like that, like, I do need, I do need help, I can't lie, because I might, I might even still need help. I might even still need help, because I'm still kind of, yeah, I'm still kind of uh, having a tough time, because I'm still in this mode. And I can't escape it. It's like a... It's like a dream where I'm, I'm stuck in turn-based mode. And I can't get out of it! Okay, we're done. We're actually out of turn-based mode. Thank God. You're all up. You're all ready for bed. And you know, the worst, most embarrassing part about this, I can't even heal because I don't have the supplies. That's, that is what is so embarrassing about this. I actually can't heal. I have no supplies. 
this is this is embarrassing. Carnival squash and putain. All we can do is a partial rest. Wow. Wow. This is not doing well for my broke allegations. Not even a pumpkin. I know, not even a pumpkin. I can't short rest. Wow, wait, so I'm just on half health. What's next? Sharp, hit us with a... Hit us with a cheeky. Oh, we love that. Hit us with another one. Oh, we love it. We can't get enough. This way. Where did the food go? Do you know what? I haven't been picking stuff up. I got cocky. I thought I had that Jeff Bezos, like Elon Musk money. I don't. I'm not rich. <laughs> I'm not rich. So I better start picking stuff up again. Like this. Hill giant finger. An acorn truffle. I didn't get the XP from Flesh. Have we clocked that? I got finessed. I got finessed. I did not get that XP. I found a glitch in the Matrix. Wow. We are Morpheus. Were you listening to me? Or were you looking at the woman in the red dress? Huh? Neo, the Matrix it is, is a set of programs. You think that's area breathing? The Matrix, goated film. Go tid, goated. And <clears throat> we are being raided by the wonderful Tamarin Pain. Welcome, 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 raiders. NB, do I have any mods installed? No, I don't. I actually only discovered what they were like last week, I can't lie. But who knows in the future, NB? Who knows? Mazura is watching. Is that right, Mermagil? My nemesis. My nemesis. Welcome, welcome, raiders. You've caught me in Balthazar's lair. Balthazar's lair. I've just sent him to the Balthazar ancestors. He's up there chilling. Do you know what I mean? My wonderful companion characters, they're a bit disheveled, but they've done extremely, extremely well. Speaking of Mizora, I've only actually encountered you, Tammy, like once, no, twice. I need to find you again. We've got we've got beef like we've actually got beef we need to settle this maybe some kind of i don't know rap battle or something i don't know how we're gonna do it i'm a baller mazora you're a pauper something something i'll send you to the <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm going to write some bars for Mazora. Quick eight bar. Quick fire rounds. Withers can be the judge, you know. Do you smell beef? Sra. That's what I've got cooking on the stove. That's what I've got cooking. Well-seasoned beef. That good grass-fed. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That good grass-fed. Right, let me... What have you got for me? An onyx and a... Putrefied tumor. That is gross. Cheers. Fire amber and silk gland. Lovely. Epic rap battles of Faerun. We've got to get it cracking. We've got to get it cracking. We'd better take a peek. Ooh. Balthazar with a little tiara. The circle of bones. We love it. We love it. And the soul cage research and a dagger. Thank you very much. What else have you got for me? Dragon egg mushroom. Bullywug trumpet. And a rogue 
rogue's morsel. Beautiful. I can also rob your whole room, Balthazar. Thank you very much, bruv. You are no longer here. Some gold, some thieves' tools, sensational. Just check for anything useful. That's what I'm saying, Shadowheart. You know, you've got that five finger discount. We love it. The bars were fireth. Fireth bars in Fey Rune. I used to be so, so sick at freestyling back in the day, you know. Like, off the dome. I would just play beats in my room and I'd just freestyle for hours. Like, hours and hours. No embellishment. So, maybe I should get back into that because I used to love it. It kept my brain very active. Do you know what I'm saying? Right. I think I've cleared this room. Balthazar, it's been an absolute pleasure, mate. Um, thanks for everything. I love the the face tats, the the blood triangles on your face. I love I love that uh, flesh. It's been real. Thank you for the recommendation on that band called Silence. I'll be listening to them a lot in the future. And to the ghoul medics, um, not the most qualified doctors I've ever encountered, but yeah, thank you very much. See you later. We move. That room has been officially cleared. Flesh is gone. Yeah, thanks for all the flesh, Serena. That's it. Flesh is done. No more. Sayonara. And now, it is time for these umbral gems to get placed in the gauntlet of Shah. I believe that is what I have to do. Oh, defo more qualified than, than, than those nurses, Brianna. A million percent more qualified. No. <laughs> No one is as bad as them. Right, so... If I give these Infinity Stones... To my ex-wife... My ex-wife... I reckon you sh... Do I... Where's the gauntlet? That's not even it. What am I doing? It's... Oh, it's there. Okay. Oh, it's... Okay, here we go. Right. That's so extra. Why are you lot not just taking the stairs? <laughs> parkour! Let me just do some parkour quickly. Uh, on our way to put the emerald gems in the altar. But first, some parkour. Right, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Who do we appreciate? Steel. I love that emote. <laughs> In one goes. Wait, this is. Insert this. one wait what do you mean wait what's wrong nothing nothing's wrong at all why are you getting me all jumpy what's don't just say that for no reason what's what's going on tell me There's something more i need to do or the trials will have been in vain there is what? a holy weapon hidden away the spear of night i have to claim it okay then use it to make a sacrifice in lady shard's inner sanctum if I succeed, I'll become a dark justicia. <laughs> the plot thickens. Key info at a time like this. A sacrifice. You intend to kill someone innocent down there. Here, even. 
you're going to turn against me, are you? Aren't you? That's that's what I feel. I'm getting um. Once again, for the second time in the stream, I'm getting a bit of Judas vibes right now. Um, I don't really know if. Mm. And look at Will's face. He's like, bruv, are you, are you really entertaining this? Damn, pressure. All right, where's this spear? Yes, this is what I'm going to say, number four. And you just figured this out by yourself just now. Yes. I know it must seem like I pulled this out of thin air, but... You did. That's how Lady Shah chose to reveal herself to me. You'll see for yourself, soon enough. We need to get that spear. There's a library in this place somewhere. That's where I need to look. Oh, okay. The plot has thickened. The plot has thickened. The plot has been doing its squats. And the plot has really thickened. So, we have a new quest we have a new quest. We have a new quest. It is... Where are you? Is it this? Oh, no. It was just an update of the old quest. So I'm saying, Daisy, the plot's looking thick right now. The plot is looking thick. <laughs> Here we go. Shadowheart revealed to us, out of the blue, might I add, <clears throat> excuse me, that in order to become a Dark Justicia, she must first acquire a weapon called the Spear of Night, hidden somewhere in the silent library. Interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. So. Still breathing, despite everything. Time to press ahead. I need to find the library. How random is this? We're looking for the library for shot. Open the door to the inner sanctum. What? So, hold up a second. Open the door to the inner sanctum. What? What? Wait, wait, wait. Are these automatic doors? There's no sensor on them. Can we open that, please? Okay. Shadowheart, man, you've completely thrown my whole thing off. Where's that quest? You've. You are. Oh, Shadowheart, what have you done? What have you done? You thought I was just gonna, you know, throw the Infinity Stones on the gauntlet, move on. Now I'm looking for a library. All right, cool. <laughs> Sharp, man. Have I cleared this? Hang on, let me just see if I've cleared this whole room. I believe I have. Oh, fake Yenny. Yogi's gone. Sayonara. 
Nani, what's going on? Welcome in. A Tammy Raider. A Tamarader. A Tamarin Raider. Right. Let me go over here. I didn't actually go to these bits, you know. Can we do a bit of parkour there? Yeah, just a, just a little bit of parkour. And can we parkour over here? You gonna join us or? Really? We just gonna, there we go. Amazing, so. Yeah, this is the Candy Crush spot. <laughs> Hanging corpse. Grim. Display. It is very, very grim. Greatly before dying and being put on show. Oh, oh. Is that the inner sanctum? Maybe. I were to jump down there, 15 HP. No, it's not worth it. That's not worth it. Maybe I don't have to jump at all. <laughs> Another Woolburn clone. I don't know. Was that Woolburn? Surely not. He gets around if that actually was him. Helmet. More for me. Is that a leather one? I'm so just a normal one. Your gear, you do not have drip like us. You do not have drip like us, but there is a heavy chest and it's marked red, which makes me think there's danger. Oh. 251 gold and some blue boots of brilliance. Yuki could not pull off a leather helmet. I don't think they do his size. <laughs> Dove, do they do his size? <laughs> wow. Added to the stash. But onwards, we need to find the library because Shart wants to read. At a time like this, really, Shart? Uh, if I go on... How do I get down there? Oh, it's just down here. How did I miss that? So obvious. All right, sweet. Down they come. <laughs> you don't do them that sized up. <laughs> you don't know Shah's good, housing, but. I'm on a side quest now for sh for shot. No, oh, this place is bare confusing, man. Cause I swear we. Okay, cool. I'll take that. I'll take that all. Can't lie, this place is incredible for gold. It's incredible. I'm going to need it. I'm going to need it. The inner sanctum. The inner sanctum. All right, let me just... 
restart. Inner Sanctum. I wonder if it's in Resurrection Money. Leafy, you know. <laughs> you know this. Find Ketherick Thorns. Oh! She's... I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. I'm so dumb. I was literally doing the right thing. And she stopped me and made me think I was doing the wrong thing. I was actually going to the inner sanctum when I was doing this. My face protects me. Oh, oh this way. Sh shut a lot, man. I was actually doing the right thing. Right. There we go. On the altar is an inscription. Brave the gauntlet of your lady Shah. Surmount her trials and rise a dark justicia. We convictions are proven. We this go. is the gauntlet of Lady Shah. Perhaps here you can show yourself to be worthy. A dark justicia at last. Recall what you read before about the trials of Shah. Or the trials of Lady Shah. Recall what they are. <laughs> Before I do that, is there anything I want to do in Act One? Hmm. What happened to Marina? <laughs> I didn't save her. That would be quite funny if I went all the way back to Act 1 to save Marina. Where even was that? How badly do I want to save Marina? How badly do I want to save Marina? Do you deserve to be saved, Marina? Were you a good person? All right. Marina, where were you again? I don't even know if I can go back that far. Shit, where were you? You were at, like, that swamp. I forget what it's called. Let me just see if Marina can be saved. Can you be saved, Marina? We're about to find out. Mighty, welcome in, welcome in, welcome in. Marina. Marina, Marina, Marina. You've got a beautiful name. That is part of the reason I'm going to try and save you. Wow, we're back here. Forward. Oh my gosh, can I find... Let me just see if the wild boar's back. Because the wild boar's me, innit? Wild boar is me. And when I say that, I mean I voice the wild boar. So I'm like... Wild boar, but he ran away like before I could speak to him. Oh. The next run, I need to hear the wild boar speak. I did, Josie, I did. But I, I can't imagine how I would have voiced the wild boar like. Really? <laughs> like, I don't. How do, how do wild boars speak? If you're not here, I might just have to point. <laughs> right. Wild boar. 
I don't think today's your day. Marina. Today may be your day. <clears throat> Am I genuinely asking how wild boars speak? Kerry, is that what you're asking? <clears throat> Excuse me. So, May Rena. Oh, in the game. Oh, oh, I I can't remember. I can't remember. Um One day though. One day. Now May Rena, I think you're in here. Anything of use? I think May Rena's in here. Here we go. If I remember correctly. Down here, right? Wow. It's been a while. Oh no, you. You. Oh. Fuck's sake. You're still here, bro. <laughs> You're still Stop! I can stop! What? Away. Away. Right. Don't I'm not picking impossible. Don't. Oh, the mask. A thief who tries to steal from Andy. Now the good Where's that mask? Here we go. Do we all need to put them on? All right, we'll do it for the culture. Looking like Stanley Ibkis. Shout out if you know that reference, Stanley Ibkis. And let your dear old Auntie Ethel look after you. Come on, Ethel. Please. Please. Stench of rot is a slap to the face. Here we go. Suddenly she is there, beside you, behind you. Hey, what? Inside you. Yeah. Don't worry. Auntie is going to take good care of you. I don't think you are, In Auntie. The hells? It's the mask. Get that thing off your face. Don't oh. Look. Don't. What? Okay, so am I gonna have to kill my character? Oh no! Can we not just? Oh, what? What's going on, bro? This mask. This is a scam. This is a scam. This is a scam. <laughs> this is what happens when you forsake the helmet. Don't look. Don't oh, wow. Rom, and I actually have to smoke my tab right now. He might actually smoke me. He's, he's kind of strong. This feels so wrong. Like, what? No, bro. Just take it off. Fuck your helmet. Why did I take that helmet off? I deserve this. I deserve this. How have I done this? 
And this guy, shut up, bruv. Please, bruv. Are <laughs> you scared? <laughs> this guy. It's like, not right now, please. Not right now. Right. I'm gonna have to take him out. Oh, this feels so wrong. You just say the same. Do you have like 12 words in your vocabulary? It's just not even I'm frightened or I'm scared or, you know, just just those like 10 words. Just 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 repeated. Just it's just an infinite cycle. What are you? Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm not even gonna pay attention to him anymore. <laughs> right. I'm gonna try and help this guy after this fight. I'm gonna try. Right. Yeah, I'm going to put a helmet on his head. That's exactly what I'm going to do. Do I actually have to kill my tab? Like, kill, kill? No, oh, this is jarring. No, oh, trust issues. Trust issues. Can you take the helmet off now? I'm done for. Sent to camp. I'm gonna take it off. <laughs> oh, wow. Got to keep fighting. Can you just kill my tab, please? It's I just want to die. Don't look. Don't. Why do I kill him? What? All right. Why do I? Why am I even here for Marina? Like, I've come here to save Marina, and I've ended up just, just killing, <laughs> I'm just killing my own companions. This is what happens when you try and do good things. This is what happens when you try and do good things. You end up just... All right. He's dead. Wow. And now we're doing that weird environmental turn-based mode thing. Why did we even come here? Wait. Wait. 
No. Sorry. No way. Yeah. We're doing deja vu. No way. No way. No way. No way. Marino? Um, I hope wherever you are, you're good. Um, look after yourself, you know, be well behaved, don't drink alcohol, get to bed early. Yes, I wish you luck. Have a great life. That's all I've got to say. That's, 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 that's all I've got to say. Hope Auntie Ethel treats you right. Hope <laughs> you get everything you want for Christmas. And yeah, yeah. Hold tight, you. Hold tight, you. Red Shamrock, love for the sub. I see you. I see you. <laughs> Pray, Rena. Pray, Rena. No, pray we Ah, <laughs> oh, pour out some henny for pray Rena. Pour out some henny for pray Rena. So let's find this library first. Am I in the? Oh, I'm here. Right. Ooh. Mighty Merv, you step away for a moment and Mayrina is dead. I mean, I like to believe that Mayrina is living happily ever after. You know, she's off grid. She's got a couple chickens, a cow, a wild boar even who speaks funnily enough and she she grows her own crops and she just lives a good wholesome life a good wholesome life just far from Faerun that's the the story I've painted for Marina <laughs> she graduated from RPG to a farming game she ascended from Baldur's Gate to Animal to Animal Crossing she I don't know her consciousness got shifted into another game, and she's living a very, very good life. She's living a very, very good life right now. Marina, we love you. We love you. <laughs> Stardew Valley, Marina. It could be Spine. It really could be. Living her best life. Exactly. We we might be taking her away from her dream life if we try and save her. Do you know what I mean? Maybe she doesn't want to be disturbed. Maybe her and Auntie Ethel are eating biscuits with, you know, a cup of milk and they're playing Connect Four and they're laughing. You know? That that hearty laugh. That like really rich person's laugh. That goes. <laughs> I can't drag her away from that. I can't. Marina, I hope you're having a lovely time. Connect Four. That was, that was Marina's favorite game, Selena Price. Come on, you don't know your Marina. You don't know your Marina facts. <laughs> right. <laughs> Where's this library? <laughs> Oh. She loves a good game of Connect Four. Ah, oh, Marina. Right. Am I going to be able to find this library? I definitely don't think it's here. Connect Four is a great game, though. It is a great game. Can't be too smart when playing Connect Four. So, okay. So, I think I'm in the right place. Oh. 
I believe I'm in the right place. Because that's the Interesting. Interesting. No, we're not going in there. Yeah, right, this library. That was... Oh, I see. Let's go down a level. Let's go down a level. Let's follow the rats. They seem to know where they're going. So it's... Is it this? Wrong! Angelique, welcome in. How are you doing? When in doubt, follow the rats, follow the rodents. Can we enter this? Oh my gosh, we can. Raw! All my days. Shit. Hello. My friends, we're going to take a break. Everybody, please go hydrate. Go eat some food or snacks or use these uh, 600 seconds to live your best life. Because when we're coming back, these, what are you called? Justicia Night Weavers are due to get smoked. Smoked. Sis08, thank you for the follow as well. I see you. We will be back in 603 seconds. Peace.
We're live and direct. Welcome back to you all. And we're hydrated. 
I love to hear it. Hydrated, hydrated, hydrated. Selena, lovely to see you in here. Welcome back all. Welcome back all. Welcome back all. We are in the library. You're here after playing D&D &D with some friends. Crinkly, I'm trying to absorb some of, some of your D&D &D powers for next week. I need them. I need them. I need them. Hydrated and I screamed. Snotra. I love that. I love that. And I just remembered I've got some ice cream in my freezer. So you've given me a little idea for later. Thank you. Spine, you forgot to hydrate. You're not too late. Get the agua or the coffee or the tequila. If you want that manic, manic Monday. Thank you for the inspiration, Crinkly. I appreciate it. Jeez. Sparkling water for Dove. And bonjour. And a crab cake sandwich. That sounds sensational. That sounds absolutely sensational. I did, I did some meal prep today. I've got one cousin. Um... And he inspired me to do some meal prep, yeah. So he, he's from Atlanta. And he posted one video on Instagram today. Okay, I would never go this out of hand on my meal prep, yeah. But this guy, he prepped like... He prepped like 18 meals or something. Like... Actually, for me, I'd prep like three meals or four meals. This guy, so he he does like bodybuilding competitions, but he's not he's not huge in it. He does like natural natural bodybuilding competitions, and like he's cooking like trays of dinner, uh, beef, fish, and then he lays them all out on his kitchen top, and he's like he's literally got like. 18, 19, 20 containers, scooping in rice, broccoli, fish, beef, turkey. And I'm just like, wow. <laughs> that is a lot of preparation, but your cooking's done, you know, for a while. And you can just, bam, the meal's right there. Do you know what I mean? Because sometimes... Whoever, who has this year, do you ever have food in your house? Like, you've got food in your fridge, yeah, but sometimes you're just in your room or you're in your living room and you're tired and you're like, I, I really can't be bothered to cook right now. And then you get a takeaway. That happens to me an annoying amount. An annoying amount. And it's actually just pure laziness at the end of the day. Because the food in my fridge isn't even bad. It's not even bad food. But I'm just like, <laughs> I'll just get a takeaway. I think, so yeah, cooking more. That is definitely something I'm working on. Definitely something I'm working on. 18 meals vegan. I think he only has like three meals a day. But yeah, that's what I was thinking. Won't it go bad? But I don't know if he freezes it. I might ask him, actually, because it was a lot of meals. And I'm like, how is your fridge even that big? <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah, take out, man. The thing is, like, I went through this phase where I can't lie, like, I was eating takeaway, like, two like two, maybe three times a day. Like, <clears throat> it was really, really bad. Like me and my old housemates, we rinsed it. We rinsed getting takeaways. We we just took it to the nth degree. Um, it was, <laughs> it was so, oh, we rinsed it. Sorry, that's a British term. That means we just did it a lot. That means we did it a lot. Um, yeah, we did it to the death, like, just eat. We were, we were quite naughty, though. Like, I remember one of my friends, 
like this is quite bad isn't it and i do not advocate anybody doing this <laughs> but one of my friends he figured out that this was like years ago in it he was like if you get something off just eat he was like and this is i'm saying i don't advocate this but he was like if you say your food's cold it's just a robot and you're speaking to a robot and the robot's like, okay, we'll give you your, your money back. And he justified it in this way. He was like, the money's not coming from the restaurant. The money's coming from Just Eat, who are this billion dollar company. This guy, I'm not even going to say his name to expose him. Yeah, they don't do it anymore. There's a, there's a real human. There's a real human behind now. I'm telling you, this guy, he got about two or three takeaways a day for like five years years like i am not joking you this guy got thousands of pounds worth of food that he and it was so simple he'd literally he, he'd order like an indian or something he'd run up the bill to like 90 pounds the food would come my food was cold the bot would just go we'll refund you that money into your account i was like what what have you stumbled across how have they not how 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 has this loophole been going on for so long he did it for 5 years he did it for 5 years no, Brianna, like he would just he <laughs> he would do his food shop on the takeaway. Like he'd just do his food shop. He'd be like, Yeah, I'm gonna eat for a few days with this one takeaway. Oh yeah, his account would get banned and he just make new accounts. Like this guy, I can't lie, he is he is an ultimate finesse. He is an ultimate finesse. I can't talk too much about this because it's not good. But he is a hustler. He is a hustler. He yeah. <laughs> Trust me. Anyone he wanted a refund off. Yeah. Incredible. And I did it a few times. I'm not going to lie. I did it a few times. I was talking to a bot. What? My food's cold. Whilst I'm eating my burger. You know, my burger's cold, man. Mmm. <laughs> yeah, my burger's cold. You don't need to give me some money. <laughs> Oh, shit. Listen, I think we I think we deserve it because these delivery fees and these service fees on Deliveroo and Uber Eats, why is my, my £15 meal gone to £30 with add-ons? Have we noticed this? Where's this service fee and delivery fee? Why is this all like $10, £10 now? What? You know them ones that they, those charges, they just sneak on to the end. So wait, what, what are you doing? They're not going to the driver. No way. No way. And they're not going to the restaurant either. It's wild. It is wild. Companies taking notes from Ticketmaster these days. Mm. You're not wrong, bone cutter. You're not wrong. Bag fees. That's not really a thing. Bag fees? Bag fees? I thought that was a joke. That sounds very like black mirror-y and dystopian. That is true, Kerry, but things are also more expensive on these apps than they are in store. Do you know what I mean? Oh, I know they charge for plastic bags in supermarkets, but they do that on Deliveroo as well. Wow. We need to be donating some bags for life to these delivery drivers. Deliveroo. Deliveroo. I don't want to think about how much money I've spent on that app. Because I would be crying myself to sleep. And Uber, you know when, do you lot remember when Uber first came out? This came out when I was in my first year of drama school, yeah. And if you remember, 
there was like a referral code in it. Do you remember when everyone was using Uber and it was just mad cheap? And there was that referral code. And if you give it to someone, then you got like five or 10 pounds to use on Uber. I remember in uni, I was hustling. Have you heard of this thing called Uber? Have you heard of this thing called Uber? Da -da 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 -da. Chatting to everyone. Use Uber, use Uber, use Uber. What's Uber? It's this thing. Da -da 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 -da. I was getting them free Ubers for a minute. I was getting free Ubers for a minute. Little little entrepreneur I was back in the day. Yeah. Move over, Jess Bezos. I've got free Ubers. <laughs> I've got free Ubers. Call me Warren Buffett. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> now, my friends, where were we? Shadowheart wanted us to come into the library. Who's this? Oh my gosh, we've got an Avenger. Thanos, is that you, bruv? No, it's not Thanos, but it is somebody of significance with their back to us. We have one, two, three, four, five, six. One is a Justice Year Avenger. The rest are... And three Justice Year Night Weavers and two Justice Year Soul Hunters. Someone is provoking the blade. You're not wrong, Mana. You're not wrong. Oh. Warren Buffet. That is a very, very good play on words, Crinkly. I see what you did there. Okay, so. The way these lot were here this whole time. Incredible scenes. Incredible, incredible scenes. Let's go. What now? You're silenced. Right, we begin. Oh, you can't even heal. Shit. I have a feeling. I thought we were just going into a library. I didn't realize it was going to be this. I should have realized. That was extremely naive of me. Can we get out of this situation? Nothing will stand in my way. Potentially. Let us. There's no tactics to this. This is just a random free-for-all. Try and make it work. Will it? Won't it? That is to be decided. Okay, here comes the Avenger. Wrong universe, bro. Wrong universe. Here comes. Wait, hold up. Okay, so you've teleported over there. Cool. Hmm. Need to stay focused. Oh, this. The spell slots aren't full. This is... Right, here we go. Come on. Bit of parkour from you, climbing the step. A little round of applause. Love that from you. Not to jinx, but they're kind of weak. I hope I don't regret that. 
but I'm not. I'm not too impressed thus far. Good night. Another fight. Let's go. You next. Fall by my hand. Here we go. <laughs> I don't think I'm going to regret it, Crinkly. I think I've got this. All for you, Shadowheart. You best be grateful. Okay, these two are in the perfect... Okay, you just moved. They were in the perfect position. And for those that don't know, I cannot heal. Yes. <laughs> Wait, what? Another one. Was a librarian. Rah! There's a librarian. Okay. What should I do? What should you do? You go for the librarian. Everyone go for the librarian. Why is it actually called the librarian? Sorry, that is quite funny. What's he doing? Right. Should have gone to... Should have gone for the librarian from the absolute beginning. Um, it's never too late, though. Nothing important is ever easy. Come on. Librarian has been defeated. We can make as much noise in the library as we like. Oh. Come on. I have only killed one <laughs> so far. This is not... This is not great. This is not great. But I believe in the team. And I think we'll bring it back. We better start bringing it back soon. I reckon. Let's see. Igmis. We love an Igmis. I reckon. Will. <laughs> I can't heal. Like, I, I used my he my healing slots. Unfortunately. Unfortunately, vegan. I... No, 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 no. This is all going wrong. Come on. Beautiful from Karlak. Lovely. Another one bites the dust. We need a few more to follow in that vein. Arabella's spell. I've never used this before, you know. Let's tangle you up, bro. Entangled. No healing potions and a healer who can't heal. 
This is a uh, not ideal. Shit. Okay. No, it's getting serious. We need to win this. No, like, this is getting, this is championship rounds, like, these lot ain't that strong. It's all gone wrong. They're just annoying. Oh, no. Um. Oh my gosh, Karlak's dead. <laughs> this is all Mayrina's fault somehow. Yeah, somehow Mayrina is responsible for this. I don't know how, but there is a connection. There is a connection. It all leads back to her. Mayrina, how, how dare you, Mayrina? <laughs> After all I've done for you. Gosh. She's the mastermind behind this. Mayrina cosplayed as the librarian. I bet that was her in the middle. You, we know what you're doing, Mayrina. We know what you're doing. <laughs> right. Can I make it out of this? Maybe not. Karlak, you dying is... Marina's the mastermind. All roads lead back to Marina. Um, I'm not going to last much longer. Which you are, please don't say that. Right. People need to die now. Come on. Hmm, thank you very much. My faith will protect me. We needed that badly. Okay. I reckon. I reckon you've got to heal yourself. Beautiful. Oh, man. Rehain, I see you with the follow. Love, love, love. Will came through. My tab's on 26 health. Shadowheart's on 18 health. Will is on 24 health. Harlak is the pearly gates. Can we get through this? Rehain, love. What's going on? First timer. You have been incepted into the fold. How, how am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? One, two, three, four, five. This one's nearly dead. Where are you? This one. Ah, cool. Damn. No, 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 no. On you. Hit and you'll heal. Beautiful. Lovely stuff from my Tav. This is going to be very, very tight. This is going to be so tight. Thank God they're missing. <laughs> Let me not speak too soon, because all my characters are 
over seventy percent damaged right now. Well, I reckon nineteen health, twenty two, twenty three. Go for this one. Half interrupted. Maybe go for this one then. Not this one. Yes. Fuck the nerves, man. There's three left. It's a three on three. It is a three on three. Can we do this? Can we do this? Can we do this? Let's finish this. Please. Ooh. Can you hit no attack of opportunity? Can you hit this one? Like you had to miss, didn't you? You had to miss to make this go down to the wire. But it's fine, I forgive you. Ooh, 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 ooh. No, 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 no. Will, don't die. They're all teleporting. We've all become Nightcrawler. Yes, okay, another one's dead. Beautiful. Can't afford to let up. You can hit this. Beautiful. One to go. Yes. Blood comes easy these days. This blood has actually been rather difficult, but I get where you're coming from. Yeah. Shit. Damn. Damn. Okay. Teleporting again. Wheels on his last legs. Come on, loves a little teleport. We are close. Beautiful. Shadowheart hitting a 16. Her all time greatest hit for me. Sometimes the only way out is through. Maybe go up here. Oh, no, 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 mate. Shit. One more hit. I'd like to think we can't possibly lose from this point, right? Right. Good night. Thank God. No, 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 no. Save. No! No, 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 no. Don't die, bro. Fuck. Fucking hell, what are they doing? Checking things out. Rav. Oh my days, he's on one hell. He's the only one that lived. What? Did you just see that? Oh my days. He's on one hell. <laughs> Oh my gosh, is he the one? This is defo a bit in the Matrix where he stops the bullets in it with his hand. Because the way that escalated and he just ended on one health and then it was just like silence. 
Wow. Okay, defo save. That was mad. That was a mad ending. Okay. That was that was mad. I can't even heal myself. Just a clue. Will you absolute G, bro? Okay, I'm not knitting you. Easy. Wow. I'm impressed. Anything hits me, yes. I'm gone. <laughs> I'm absolutely gone. I will loot as much as I can. Well, mate. You've low key been the MVP today. These, I don't know what's waiting for me around here, so I'm trying not to. Frankly, I hope so. I hope so. I've been looting a lot, lot more, so. Yeah, bro. Looking like a boss. Looking like a boss. Take a little picture on the chair. Will someone take a picture of me? Yeah, bro. You look sick. You look incredible. Right. I can't go through that door. Right. Right, right, right. Okay, so. So, so, so. We need to rest. You can't fast travel right now. All right, okay. Who has the money? You. Just, yeah, just let me... <laughs> Do you remember when you got money as a child and you give it to your parents or your mum and she's like, I'll look after that for you. Did I ever see that money again? No. <laughs> <laughs> Let me look after it for you. Will you? Yeah. Never onward. To this day, I ain't seen that money. <laughs> to this day, I'll look after it for you. Fate spins along as it should. Right. Dost thou require a new ally? Or mayhaps a resurrection? A resurrection. A few, a few resurrections, please. Then thou must return with the proper payment. Good thing we found all that money. This is the price of balance. With us has drip, Natari. Incredible well drip. Counted. I recommend keeping my distance for a moment. By doom and dusk, I strike thy name oh. from the archives. My mum would just borrow it. Bye. Oh, Mrs. Stream. I've been there. Lady Aqua, thank you for the follow. I think I've told one story on stream before, yeah? This is actually a deep story. Imagine we we have these things called post offices, post offices in the UK. Maybe everyone in the world has them, but yeah, it's where you send posts, you can exchange money, etc. And um, my first like bank account was a post office bank account, and um, like I would put like any money, like two pound, three pound, any money in to my post office bank account. I was really good at saving when I was young. And like I had a paper round and stuff when I was young. I would always put my dough into it. And then I remember I'd saved up like 310 pounds, which is, bear in mind this was like, I don't know, 16, 17 years ago. That's a lot of money. 
even now that's quite a lot of money 310 pound but back then that was like all my birthday money my christmas money everything and then i remember one day like well, I knew there was, like, this little blue book I had in it, like, always showed me my balance. And I remember one day, like, I went to the post office and I checked my balance and it wasn't there, like, my money wasn't there. I was like, what the fuck? Like, I've been saving this for, like, for time, for ages. To cut a long story short, yeah, how have my par my own parents have robbed me? I think I've gone to them. In fact, I need to I need to I need to pull them up about this again. Like, I think I've gone to my dad. Like, brother. Like, I'm so so serious. I'm so serious. He he must have. I think he said something like, "Yeah, we." we, we He's such shit <laughs> for this. He, I think he said like, yeah, like if we went on a holiday. I think he said something like we went on a holiday or something. And I was like, the thing is, I was too young to be able to to be like, what the fuck, bro? Like you, you kind of have just that's my net worth. Do you know what I mean? Three hundred pounds was my net worth at that age. That was actually my net worth in that post office thing. Um, oh, parents taking their kids' money. The thing is, it's not right, but the parent owns the child in it, so <laughs> they shouldn't be able to take their money, but I mean, they did take me on a lot of holidays, so, but still the principal the principal, the principal, come on. That was tough. That was tough to go through. I'm not gonna lie. And I can't even short rest, so Will's gonna have to stay on one HP. I know, Daisy, I know. Do you know, I've always been good with my money and like good at saving. Even from that young age, I was quite like, you know, get my two pound, put it there. Two pound, innit? What's two pound? But that was at like the age of 13 or 14. Maybe 13, I saved up all that money, which was pretty good. And I had a paper round and yeah, they didn't pay me much. They did not pay me much. I'm actually gonna message my my mum right now. Remember when you stole that money from me? No, I'm not going to say it that harshly. I'm going to say... How should I word this? I'm going to... I'm going to... Okay. I'm going to catch her in it. I'm going to say, do you remember that? Do you remember... That post office... Account? <laughs> Yeah, I text my mum whenever, Cypher. I text my mum whenever. Do you remember that post office account I used to have, which had £310 in it? She won't respond now, but we, we, we will, we will, uh, I will let you know her response. No, Cypher, trust me. If my mum doesn't want to respond to me, she won't. Like, my mum will just air me. She, she's, she's known for doing that. She's known for blue ticking me. If she doesn't want to respond now, she won't. Don't worry about that. My mum will leave me on red. Yes, she will. I'll ask a question. She'll blue tick me. I'll be like, oh, okay, cool. Didn't even want to know anyway. That's fine. 
That's absolutely fine. You can just do that. <laughs> it's brutal, but she's my mum, innit? She can do what she wants to me. Like, that's fine. That is absolutely fine. What what Jen is? She's a is she a boomer? She's a boomer. Maybe she doesn't mean to to leave me on red, or she does what I do sometimes and responds in her head. Responds in her head and doesn't actually respond on the phone. It's very problematic. As you can see, Will is still on one HP, and there's nothing we can do about it. Actually, there is. Can you heal him? No, actually, there's nothing we can do about it. Shark, you're going to go first. Let's get this thing open. We're going to lockpick this. And we need a huge roll. It's not going to cut it. That is not going to cut it. Failure. Roll again. Come on. Show me something. Beautiful. Your mom says okay if she doesn't want to respond. My mom hits me with the okay as well. I can't lie. But in my mom's head, that's not rude. But you know when you just get the yep. Yeah. Or Jemba back in the day, just K. Come on, can you elaborate, please? Please. Oh, my mum with technology. She's better now, to be fair. She's better now. I'm becoming the person bad with technology. Here we go. The iron portcullis door opens. And we are in. So, Shadowheart. Best avoid that trap. Oh, right. Oh, there's a trap. Can we disarm this? Ooh, okay. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Three rolls to go. And we're rolling a three. We need something a lot higher than that. Come on, Sharp. Come on, Sharp. Give us something to get excited about. Oh, she's done it. You got your dad on TikTok the other day at Skit. Do you know what? I'm going to make a TikTok, by the way, everyone. I'm going to make a TikTok, and then I'm going to post, like, my clips from Twitch on TikTok. Um, yeah. TikTok. I've never... People send me TikToks, but I don't have... TikTok in it, so I can't really open it like that. But I'm joining the TikTok cult. I'm joining the TikTok cult. It's gonna be good. It's gonna be good. Heard a lot about you TikTokers. Nah, Cypher. I don't have TikTok. Ooh, okay, so. Ready to catch brain rot. I think so. I think so. No, nah, because TikTok always... I don't know who's first, but like... It's either TikTok or Twitter. Or X, if you want. Because Twitter is quick, I can't lie. Twitter comes out with like, you know, like um, meme material or reels. Instagram's always last. TikTok might be first, but Twitter's quick as well. Twitter is very, very quick as well. Right, so. Yeah, Twitter's first, TikTok close second, yeah. Facebook. Facebook is raw facebook you know facebook was 
I can't even remember the last time I was on Facebook. A long time ago. Does anyone still use Facebook? I'm actually so interested. One of my... One of... I, the thing is, why I like Facebook is because bare of my old memories are there. Bare of them. Like, oh, just parties I went to and people I worked with. You know, it's just all... So many memories that I would never... And pictures, pictures that I wouldn't be able to find anywhere else is on Facebook. I might even just log in like one day, see what it's saying. Right, so we are in the Iron Portocollis, by the way. I am going to pull... What can silence the night song? I have no idea. Do I have... In fact, let me pull this. I've pulled the lever. Okay, you still use Facebook Cypher. I, I, there is some people that I can only contact through Facebook. So I should go back on it. Um and see yeah and my old facebook messenger chats man oh my gosh oh my gosh that would be a blast from the past i might do it see what i dig up let's see okay 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 we've got another trap Yikes. Okay, cool. Hold up. Where's this spear? <laughs> Crinkly, them old school chats. If I look up some of the chats that I used to have back in the day with girls, I would just... <laughs> The, the cringe level would just be so high. I don't even think I'd be able to read them. Like, even just thinking about them now, I'm just like, oh, man. <laughs> what were you saying, bro? Honestly, honestly, I'm actually scared to even open them. No, Crinkly, I love that for you. I absolutely love that for you. <clears throat> but for me, uh yeah, I mean something good here. I, <laughs> I need to see. I need to see just for the memories. Just for the memories. Right, where's this spear? So you wanted this spear, right? Hmm. What's this? What's that? Or what's that instead? Can't get in there. Hmm. Next time's the charm. Interesting. No, 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 no. Is there a trap there? No. What can silence the night song? Some kind of book? <laughs> Some kind of book. Interesting. What can silence the night song? What can silence the night song? This book. <laughs> Riddle of the night. Riddle of the night. Do I have that? I don't even know if I do. <clears throat> I don't even know if I do. Is it in here?
seconds. Is it in here? I actually have no idea. Let me search the books. Looks like a trap there. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Beautiful. All right, y none of you move. Don't step on the traps. Just let me do my thing. Lovely stuff. I love books. I've got a thirst for knowledge. All the books. What can silence the night song? I don't know, Amelia. <laughs> Right. My friends, what can silence the night song? What can silence the night song? We will find out on the next episode because one, I don't know what can silence the night song. Two, this guy's on one HP, on his last legs, unfortunately. Um, oh my gosh, he almost stepped on that trap. Bruv. So we're going to save. And we're going to come back to this gang of leather helmeters. And find out what silence is the night song. Because we actually can't get through. Can we? Wait, how did that wall go solid? I swear that was... Hmm. Next time's the charm. Maybe not. Maybe not. That's not going to work. Apparently, it's not going to work, everybody. So, we will be back to this. We will be back. But we have made sensational progress. We've killed flesh. We've killed flesh. We've, we've killed the ghoul medics. And we've killed Balthazar, the man with the open, wounded tattoos on his face. It's been sensational. We've got the Umbral Gems. We're just doing a little side quest for Shadowheart. She wanted to come to the library. And most importantly, in this stream, what have we done? What have we done? We have left Marina to live a good and happy, happy life. Because, you know, we care a lot about Marina here. So, mad love to Marina, innit? She's... <laughs> she holds a special place in my heart. And, uh... I think the quest was lying. I don't think she needs saving. I think she's absolutely fine on her farm with her chickens. So, my friends, thank you for joining me once more. And I will see you all tomorrow. Tomorrow, where we continue with Fears to Fathom. Yeah, that game. Hashtag blood pressure going up. Thank you all. Thank you all. Thank you all. Spooky time indeed. Hashtag October. Hashtag Halloween. Good night, my friends. I will see you all tomorrow. And please go and show some love to Jay. I'll catch you soon. Peace.